Well, welcome to another update of our behind the scenes on our six film series project that we're in the middle of. We just finished our shooting in Orlando. It was just an incredible time. God worked out all the details and we've got footage now in the can. In fact, uh, we're in the process of doing some of the edits and putting it together and we're hoping to show you some of the raw footage uh, here in the next couple of days. So be sure and check back and you'll see some of the uh, original footage uh, before it gets uh, final edits and music put to it. We're gonna give you a glimpse of what we captured in Orlando. It's just incredible stuff. But we've been asked, why is Crown moving into short films? And so I just wanna briefly answer that question. About seven years ago, during a trip to Africa, I realized that half the world cannot read. And if we were gonna be relevant to reaching the world with the gospel and with the message of what God says about money, we had to reach them by their preferred learning style. So half the world prefers to learn through story. They tell oral stories and they learn visually. And so to move into short film was a way to take God's word and put it into a new relevant medium. Matter of fact, if you wanna know a little bit more in depth about that original journey, you can go to our link called The Making of the Widow and the Oil. It's right here on this blog. And you can watch about a 10 minute segment on how we came to be where we are today. But real quickly, here's what we're trying to accomplish. We've done the widow and the oil, that was our beta test. Now we're doing five more stories and we're doing parts of those. Uh, it's like a jigsaw puzzle. We did part of them in Orlando and now we're moving to Utah where we're gonna finish them up. We'll start with Abram's reward. That's the story of when Abram divides his possessions with Lot, an incredible financial choice that he made right there and when he tithes to Melchizedek. An incredible story that uh, we can't wait to get done. That's all gonna be done in Utah. Then we're gonna do Abram and, uh, Abraham and Isaac. What a powerful emotional drama. That's gonna be the cornerstone piece of this series, which will be called God Provides. And then we're also gonna do uh, The Rich Man and Lazarus from Luke 16. We're gonna do Jeremiah 29. You saw the soldiers uh, at the fall of the temple, the fall of Jerusalem. That's the opening of Jeremiah 29 when the Israelites were taken into exile and then what God taught them when they had to start over with nothing. We're also going to do Lift It Up and that's the presentation of the gospel as presented in John chapter 3 when Nicodemus seeks out Jesus and asks him uh, if he in fact is the Messiah. So those are the projects that are underway right now. Our next steps are to finalize all the production detail get our staff, crew, all the volunteers out on location in Utah, and then we'll go for six days, 12 hours a day shooting. You should also know that Dean Jones has signed up, Dean Jones of Disney fame, of uh, Herbie the Love Bug, and many, many, many other wonderful credits. He signed on to play the part of uh, Abraham. So he's gonna be the lead role in Abraham and Isaac. And also, you'll remember when the rich man and Lazarus die, they go and meet Abraham. So Dean Jones will play that part as well. And when Abraham meets Lot and ties to Melchizedek. So it's going to be wonderful. I just ask you to continue praying. We've got a lot happening this week. But that's why Crown's moving into short film. We don't know when the series is going to be completed. But as soon as it is, it's going to be posted on this blog. So check back all the time. We're going to continue to communicate with you about the series, posting the videos, the photos, all of our progress until the series is done. Thank you for praying with us. Uh, thank you for supporting us, keeping track of what's going on. Don't forget, we need financial partners. I can't think of a better time for you to get involved with Crown because God has called us to reach the world with this message at this time, and this is gonna be a highly leveraged way to get the message out. I would ask that you consider joining us as a financial partner in this endeavor. We'll be back soon to give you more updates. Stay tuned.